Hello everybody, welcome to beach walk vlog number 13 and with this beach walk vlog today I wanted to talk to you about the changes that are going to be happening to the runners rehab and the basic eight and I wanted to talk to you about why they're going to be happening and uh, a few other things a few other changes that are going to be occurring as well so firstly let's talk about why this is happening well because the sling method is always changing maybe at some point it will stop changing uh, but for the moment it's always changing and for the last five years uh, it's been changing a lot and it's been changing quite rapidly and it's been a while since I actually did an update to the runners rehab and the basic eight. I've done some small little updates uh, in the last kind of 18 months, 24 months, but this one's going to be a big one. And this one is a complete revamp, total rewrite. And I'm going to be including a lot of things that are going to sort of empower you, the runner, to do more on your own. And one of the things that I always said from the very beginning was what was the point of the sling method and especially the runners rehab and the basic eight it was all about making you the runner your best therapist now nobody knows your body like you do you are in your body 24 hours a day seven days a week 365 days per year you're in your body you know what you do you know exactly what you put your body through you know what it's capable of and if you are given the right information if you are more learned more knowledgeable you will be able to make the relevant changes to your training to your body that you need to make to make it last you forever well not forever but you know what i'm saying for a long long time now i want you to be running injury free pain free running better, running uh, with more confidence, running with more endurance, running with more stamina, running with more strength, power, resilience. I want you to be doing all those things as a runner. I want you to be doing it because you are empowered to do it yourself, not to be reliant upon other people to do it for you. And the way that you can do that is with the sling method and the runners rehab and the basic eight is where it starts. Now it, it goes on beyond that. It goes to the intermediate 10, the rotational torque training and the centrifugal force training. And in the last year, I've also added the sling method for golf to uh, the offerings of the sling method. So there's, you know, it's evolving in different ways, but for, for the sake of runners, what I always wanted to do was empower you, the runner, with the information that you need to be able to make the changes and fix all the issues, the problems, the, you know, the running stride mechanics, the posture, uh, all of these things. I wanted to be able to hand over all of that power through knowledge, through education, to you. Now, there is no other running specific or endurance running specific training method out there that does anything close or anything even similar to the sling method and what the sling method does because the sling method is educational we have instructors in different countries uh, who have all taken the sling method level one course or indeed level two course as well now um, and uh, that was one of the offerings from 2020 just as we just as COVID hit us we all know about that um, I was going to be doing some level one courses in New York and in London and um, when COVID hit I decided to put that onto Google Classroom and make that available to anybody without having to travel and you know it's been successful we've got coaches in different countries now uh, Australia uh, New Zealand I think um, the UK and uh, in the US as well on the East Coast and the West Coast so it's growing it's getting out there and the reason why is because it works and because the feedback is, is amazing the the uh, results are amazing when you put the work in and you've got to put the work in 
always, 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 you've got to put the work in, otherwise nothing changes. You won't change unless you change, and part of that change is, I've got to put the work in, all right? Now, what I've done uh, over this last edit, I've put some serious work into uh, the new version 5 of the Runner's Rehab and the Basic 8. And uh, I'm going to be uh, teaching you not only uh, what every joint in the body or every, every kind of important joint that is in the body should do, teaching you how to use it, but I'm also going to be teaching you how to integrate it. I'm going to be teaching you step-by-step -step gait analysis. You'll be able to get the software to do that for free. It's a free download. Um, and all you will have to do is shoot your own videos, which I'll empower you with the knowledge of how to do that. Um, so you can go out and shoot your own slow-mo videos. And then you can use that software to get the exact screenshots that you need to get. And I will teach you how to do that. I'll be creating a video um, and showing you how to use that software and that will enable you to go ahead and do your own gait analysis. Now, that's the first part. The second part is these movements or going through the process, the runner's rehab process, the first two weeks of MFR, and then we work on specific movements of the body. We've got torque wraps, we've got body wraps. These are things that you're gonna have to get the update for to find out what they all are. Um, you will be working on internal rotation. You will be working on torso rotation, pelvis rotation, shoulder girdle elevation depression, pelvis elevation depression. You will be working on all of this fantastic stuff. And I'm gonna teach you and empower you how to do it all. But it starts with that gait analysis. All right, the next step after the MFR and all of those uh, torque wraps, uh, body wraps, using the bands, after that comes the integration of the Basic 8. Now, in the Basic 8, in the original Basic 8, which is still there in version 4, there's been a few changes um, from versions 1 to 4, a few additions, um, taken out a few, couple of things that didn't really need to be there and included some new stuff. Um, like the rusty bolt for example um, now in the new basic eight there's going to be progressions built in to the basic eight that you get in the training manual oh yeah that's another thing before i go on there's going to be an ebook and a separate training manual so whereas before when everybody said um hey i've got my ebook and then some people said, where do I start? Well, what do I do? And I would say, go to chapter five. Well, now that no longer exists. There is a training manual and you start on page one. Woohoo! And that is how it always should have been from the very start. If I'm honest, it should have just been chapter one, you just get started. But now, I didn't want to take anything away. I didn't want to take away that knowledge, that education, that information. So what I've done is I've put that into an ebook. So that now is an ebook filled with different links that you can click on and research. And there's lots and lots of research in there. And you can click on the highlighted areas to get the research and read all that if you want to. Um, or you don't. You don't have to. You don't. You don't have to read it. You can just go straight to the training manual, pick up the training manual, and start on page one chapter one and that's where it all starts so you will get two pdfs and you will either choose to read the ebook the new updated ebook which is um if i'm honest it's pretty fantastic it's full of myth busting um different myths that circulate around the running running world and uh facebook being a huge uh, perpetuator of that along with Instagram and TikTok. Let's not get into that though. Um, but there's tons of myth busting there. Uh, things that you shouldn't be doing. 
uh, in order to be a super fantastically functional human being. Things that you shouldn't be doing in order to fix injuries, whether that be acute or chronic, um, like stretching and icing. And there's other things in there as well, like, uh, you know, Epsom salt baths. Yeah, you know, hot bath with some Epsom salts. It smells good, probably feels good. Not really doing very much. In fact, it's not really doing anything at all. Um, it's just a waste of money. But anyway, if you enjoy it, do it. That's cool. If you don't and you don't want to spend money on Epsom salt because it doesn't do anything, um, just take a hot bath and you'll be getting exactly the same benefit. So anyway, there's stuff like that in there. Uh, some myth busting. Um, stuff that's going to, if you're somebody who uses Epsom salt, um, it's going to save you a lot of money. Um, and also something else that's going to save you money is just doing the runner's rehab and the basic eight and becoming a better moving human being. It will probably save you money on running shoes because your running shoes will last you longer. How many times do you read that across the social medias? Oh, my running shoes have only lasted me 250 miles or even less than that in some cases. Probably because your running biomechanics are terrible. Um, and that's something that would change by fixing your... Uh, or for running biomechanics, you'll probably save yourself a ton of money. So what you'll spend on it, you'll save that within six months. Whoopee! All right, it's you know it's things like that that really make a big difference. So there's going to be those progressions in the basic eight. There's going to be lots of progressions in the basic eight. Um, each video starts with a basic movement, and then we add on the progressions and. Um, there's in some I think there's five progressions I think um, I think that's the uh, exercise six the hip thruster um, there's uh, I think there's five progressions there's also a brand new exercise or two um, just some changes some little changes there's an exercise called the wing nut yeah rusty bolt and the wing nut you can't get much better than that can you I'm creative, right? <laughs> so, um, yeah, so there's a, there's a lot of changes there. There's also, there's also going to be a return to running program. Um, there's going to be a uh, run walk program, that's what that is. Then there's going to be a 5k, uh, uh, actually the 5k program is built into the run walk program. Um, then there's going to be a 5 to 10k program, a 10k to half marathon program, and a half marathon to marathon program as well. Um, so yeah, there's, there's going to be a lot of stuff in there. Um, there's a section on running fitness and heart rate training, lactate threshold training, training to threshold, using threshold uh, as your guide for pacing. So uh, lactate pacing training um, we talk about 80 20 uh, we talk a little bit about uh, 90 10 and yeah, that's a, that might be a new one for some of you 90 10 well it's along the lines of 80 20 uh, it's just 90 10 and talk about lots of different things in that ebook and then the training menu as I said separate um, so what else is changing uh, pricing structure um, my goal is to get costs down, the entry entry cost down. Um, so although uh, the ebook price, because uh, you're going to get the ebook and the training manual, that is going up a little bit. However, the price of the ebook and the uh, resistance band and toe spreader set uh, that is going to stay the same. So it's even more encouraging. That makes the uh, purchase of the bands and the free toe spreaders, uh, or the included toe spreaders, the best price online. You will not be beating that price. Um, so you, you may as well just get that bundle to start with. Um, but what I'm also doing is I am lowering the, uh, the barrier cost or the entry cost to the gate analysis. So because I'm going to be empowering you to do your own gait analysis, I'm going to be uh, creating a new service that I'm going to offer, which is a basic gait analysis, um, which is 
uh, a few screenshots um, and I will you will do your running videos you'll do your slow-mo running videos with my help um, and again empowering you with the knowledge and the information to do that better um, better than ever ever before and then I will do some screenshots and send them to you um, nothing will be going on the Facebook group the private group it will all be done um, between you and I it will all be done in private there will be other options uh, other included options like a 30 minute Skype console video call console because you know I do uh, lots of online coaching lots of online Skype one-on-one uh, -on -one Skype coaching uh, the sling method is what I do in that uh, working with injured runners working with runners who are not injured all over the world um, on all continents that's really cool um, so I'm going to be bringing that to you at a lower cost um, different service the the full uh, video production service with the Skype uh, call is still going to be in there as well that's 249 for the whole uh, for the whole the full gate analysis and that of course um, includes a 12 week or 16 week plan um, and that includes the 249 includes the new runners rehab and the basic eight when it is done so that's going to be even better value and there's lots of bundle deals on the page as well um, so yeah there's going to be a few little changes there um, and uh, I'm sure um, I'm sure that all of that is just going to be in there as improvements to help you get better and to help you be empowered more because that basically is my goal to empower you the runner to help yourself um, so yeah I think if I'm completely honest I think that you will be able to do a better job at doing gait analysis than most physical therapists and that was one of the things that I started out with that was my <clears throat> that was my original goal was to uh, empower and educate you to be able to do a, the best gait analysis that you could possibly do better than uh, better than most physical therapists out there and that's not putting physical therapists down in any way it's just that they're not using my method they're not using the sling method um, and they're not um, they're not as informed about the gait cycle as you will be after you have the new runners rehab and the basic gait and it's, that's it basically um, yeah it's and the reason for that is is pretty simple um, it's because you know I, I I get a lot of injured runners coming to me who in their words I've tried everything I've done everything I've had a gait analysis and nothing it showed nothing and I respectfully I say to them um, you haven't had my gait analysis and I haven't looked at you run so um, and, the, and the reason for that is because I look for very specific things um, during your running video uh, during your gait cycle I look for very specific things that other people don't look for and the reason why they don't look for them is generally because they don't know to look for them and they don't know why they're happening and um, if they don't know to look for them and they don't know why they're happening or put that the other way if they don't know that they're happening and they don't know to look for them then they're gonna say they might say to you, yeah, it all looks good, it looks great, you look fine. When in reality, it's not. It's not fine, because you're injured. And after having that gait analysis, um, and, and doing some exercises here and there, some usually some pretty random stuff, um, nothing specific to the gait cycle, um, you're still in the same situation that you were always in. So, you know there's two things there either you're not being honest and you weren't doing the work in the first place which I very 
I believe that you were. I believe that you were doing the work. Because why wouldn't you? You're injured and you want to not be injured, right? Now, there's also the other side of that, which is that you weren't being honest. And you weren't doing the work. And um, you could have got some benefit from doing what you were prescribed. Chances are probably wouldn't. Because if it's the wrong stuff, it's the wrong stuff. And it's not going to benefit you if it's the wrong stuff, right? Um, but let's just say you weren't honest and you weren't doing the work. Um, now, now you're going to do the work because you know why you're doing the work, right? You know why. If most, a lot of people, a lot of the time, when they know why they're doing something, they're more inclined to do it. You're more inclined to do something when you know why you're doing it, right? Um, so that's that's kind of my goal with with the gate analysis. Um, my goal is to empower you to know why you're doing it, and that's where the the, the, the best gate analysis in the world, I call it, um, is with the sling method because it's specific for endurance runners. Um, it's not to say that it won't help everybody because it, it it will because we're working on we're working on human movement of every joint in the body, so it will help everybody. But, uh, you know, I'm specifically talking to you endurance runners and triathletes about your running. <coughs> and, uh, yeah, there we go. So there's going to be some changes made to the website. There's going to be quite a few changes made to the website. So we're planning on having uh, all of the exercises, all of the videos, the exercise videos, the MFRs, the runner's rehab, the basic eight, um, all of everything there we're planning on having that access through the website through a member portal um, so you'll get a, an ID a login ID to the website and you'll then log into the website we're hoping to have a chat forum uh, something a little bit like uh, slow twitch or one of those uh, endurance forums or you know my car doesn't work forums you know Volkswagen owners club or uh, Tesla owners club or whatever Porsche owners club one of those online forums um, where you can then just uh, post questions in there <clears throat> the Facebook group will remain um, for people that don't want to upgrade and for people that do want to upgrade um, and also for me to interact with them and you and everybody else so you know the social media the Facebook group is not gonna is not gonna disappear um, although the uh, the way Facebook is working right now is kind of uh, pathetic if I'm honest um, they're really not showing posts to people um, they're not putting it out there to people putting it into their news feeds um, so yeah, it's, uh, it's becoming quite hard work with Facebook, so you never know what could change in the future. Uh, maybe we go to Instagram more, who knows? Um, or maybe we just put it all through the, through the uh, website uh, forum and do it through there. Who knows? Um, but yeah, <coughs> you know, all shares, all likes, all of that stuff is super, super important for me. Um, I really appreciate uh, everybody who gets involved and who posts to the Facebook groups. Super important. I appreciate that. It's fantastic to have you doing that. And I obviously, of course, like the opportunity to help you. So, you know, you, you post questions, you post videos for, for comments, for constructive feedback. I will still do that. Um, so, yeah, that's the, that's the changes that are going on. There's quite a lot changing and quite a lot of really good stuff that's going to be happening in the future um, and uh, there'll, there'll be hopefully there'll be an in-person level one course coming to the UK probably on the outskirts of London most likely um, maybe for next year we'll see if we can get that into place um, and then once this ebook training manual and everything is done, I will be then um, working on my next section, which is going to be uh, tennis, sling method for tennis. 
um, because I know there's some tennis coaches out there who would love that. Um, And uh, postnatal, sling method for postnatal. Now obviously that only applies to women, um, but uh, it's something that I've wanted to do for a long time. Um, Sling method postnatal, I think that's gonna be fantastic. Um, because obviously a lot of things change in your body when you have a baby and the uh, the road back needs to be simple. It needs to be very simple and very effective um, to get uh, a postnatal body back to how it should work and function. And the sling method is the absolute best way to do that. I've worked with a number of uh, postnatal women um, who have actually had uh, diastasis recti uh, after giving birth for a, a you know for a, a good period of time after and not been able to get it back and subsequently they have used the swing method and they have no diastasis recti so that is super cool I have that uh, evidence um, to back up um, actual evidence to back that up which is fantastic because I love that um, what matters is your results um, it doesn't matter really what research studies say what matters are the results that we get through doing what we do um, I don't need a I don't need an actual study if anybody wants to you're welcome to um, you have to follow the protocol though but um, you know just your results when I hear of people saying oh my goodness I managed to run four miles pain free or oh my goodness I PR'd in this race after chronic years and years of chronic injury oh my goodness I just ran the fastest six miles ever in my life after years of chronic injury oh my goodness I can't believe that my pain levels have gone down after only two weeks oh my goodness blah 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 and it goes on and on and on and this these results this incredible feedback from you just you know spurs me on to keep doing what i'm doing because just like you those are the results that i'm getting um i'm getting older um and i'm recovering recovered from the injuries the chronic injuries that i had the chronic pain that i had for 28 29 years 30 years even um even more than that think it was but anyway pain free is the place to be and I'm loving that and I'm loving the fact that everybody else is loving that and um, so keep sharing the sling method with runners out there who are injured whether that be acute injuries so that they can not do the things um, like icing resting elevating taking Uh, anti-inflammatories and all that kind of rubbish Um, and actually loading the tissues the way that they should be loaded to get those tissues to adapt to the forces and stresses and strains that the gait cycle is going to place them under so that they can then do that during their rehab because if you're not placing the, the correct stresses and strains on the tissues and you're not working on your pronation and supination which is one of the big things that we're going to be doing in the runner's rehab and you're not working on your pelvis function which is one of the big things that we're going to be doing in the runner's rehab and you're not working on your uh, shoulder elevation and depression which is what we're going to be doing in the basic eight and you're not working on your breathing function which is also another big thing that we're going to be doing uh, in the runner's rehab there's so much coming in this update it's it's insane Um, The production level of the videos is super high quality. I have done voiceovers in those videos, uh, tirelessly done voiceovers and captions. Uh, I've listened to what you've said. Even even deaf people will be able to follow along because there's voiceovers, uh, because there's captions, sorry. Um, And yeah, it's... uh, it's just going to be so 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 incredibly amazing i'm so excited about it i i just want to get it done 
Um, I'm, I'm not procrastinating on it. My wife will tell you that I'm not procrastinating on it because uh, she's barely seen me in the last few months, <laughs> well, apart from our holiday. Uh, you know, I'm just putting all my time into that, into this, uh, to get this out there as soon as I can because I want this to be in your hands. I'm excited for this to be in your hands and I'm excited to see uh, how much these new running drills, odds and evens, yeah, new running drills, um, getting you to land on a backward traveling foot. There's going to be progressions of how to make that happen. I'm listening to you. I'm hearing you. I know what you want. I know what you need because I'm listening to you. I'm not just wildly off on my own journey. I'm listening to you. I'm not just bringing you a single program to strengthen your glutes for $49.99 and then $9.99 a month thereafter. That's crap. That needs to go out the window. All of that needs to go out the window. Planks need to go out the window. Squats for runners. Nope. Nope. It needs to go out the window. Um, yeah. This is, this is the thing. The sling method, the runner's rehab and the basic cake. This is the thing. And it's going to be incredible. And I'm, I'm rambling now and I'm going to switch off. So I just wanted to give you this update in my beach walk blog number 13. Um, I hope you can't wait to get it in your hands. Because I can't wait to put it in your hands. Uh, lots of work still to do. Um, but I'm... I'm planning on the next uh, four weeks. It's all going to be done. Hopefully. I will talk to you soon. Have a fantastic rest of your day, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, talk to you soon. Beachwalk Blog 14. Bye.